every racing driver sacrifices in some element of their life. Back in the early 70s, Hurley was like a superhero. He did things that nobody else had ever done. He could take any car and drive it at the limit. If you'd ever cast a racing car driver in a movie, it would be Hurley Haywood. My name's Hurley Haywood. Come on with me and let's go for a ride. The fame came by surprise. He was like an overnight rock star. He just was the real deal. To me, Hurley Haywood is a legend. He's the quintessential race car driver, without question. For Hurley, driving was a relief of sorts. It gave him his identity that he couldn't have off the track. I was sponsored by Penthouse Magazine. Handsome race car driver, beautiful model. Hurley, how old? I am uh, 31. And unmarried? Unmarried. <laughs> as long as I was able to hold my foot down longer than the guy next door to me, that's when anybody looked at. This is the first time I've talked about this to anybody publicly. On the one hand, is a sizzling hot racing driver. And on the other hand, he was the antithesis of that. Racing for me, it's like a fragile love story. There's a person that stands behind him or her that helps support. It's not easy to talk about. He did what he had to do in order to survive at that time. It's almost like, how did he do this? The best kept secret in motor racing. It's time to be vocal about it, and I just didn't want to lie about it anymore. It isn't always about winning the race. Sometimes it's about being true to yourself.